assalamu alaikum i am abdul rahman from bs chemistry today the topic of my presentation is minorities in pakistan what is religious minority a minority religion is a religion held by minority of the population of the country state or region people who belong to a minority religion may be subject to a discrimination or prejudice especially when the religion difference correlate with the ethnic difference pakistan is an islamic country in pakistan and pakistan is the second most populous muslim country with an estimated population of 212 million from these from approximately 5.7 percent takriban 11 million of the total population these includes hindus christians parsis buddhist ahmadis it is through they are spread all over the country the majority of non-muslims are concentrated in few pockets over 80 percent of non-muslim in pakistan is with the christians and or hindus the graph there show the religious population by region according to literature view review pakistan is predominantly muslim country with over 90 percent of its population following the islamic faith however there are 11 million people live in pakistan who are not muslim and who follows various faiths this includes christians hindus Sikhs, and parsis now we talk about kaidism the founder of pakistan views about minorities you are free to go to your temples you are free to go to mosque and or any other place of worship in the state of Pakistan. You may belong to any region or caste or creed that has nothing to do with the business of the state. A legislative in the country and other elected bodies shall be constituted or defined principles of adequate and effective representation of minorities in your province without reducing the minority in any province to a majority or even quality. Islam and minorities. Principal law in suffering affairs of this law, Muslims and non Muslims are equal and alike. Minority of Debia, Fernal of Java, people of Nigerian, minorities freedom in Usman Empire. According to the context of Quran, and if any one of the pagans sacred Islam or Muhammad, then give him Islam and afterwards convey him to his policy of safety. Convey him to his place of safety. According to setting second context of Quran, there shall be no compulsion in acceptance of the region. The right course has become clear from the wrong. So, whoever disbelieves to get and believes in Allah has God grabbed the most trustworthy hand and wood with no break in it and Allah is hearing and knowing according to the law of minority article 25 all citizens are equal belong before law and are entitled to equal protection of law article According to Article 2A of Constitution of 1973, wherein adequate provision shall be made of the minorities to freely profess and practice their religion and develop their culture. According to the Law of 36, Protection of Minorities, the state shall be safe, guard the legitimatic rights and interests of minorities and including their dues, representation in federal and provisional service. Laws in Pakistan for minorities. The right of religion minorities, while partially coded, cod, codified in the Constitution of 1973, are not protected by the state. Why? Islam, by promoting as dominating force, is often made to impose upon their life. Such we see the implementation wave of extremism in the second law theory decades discrimination against Hindus and Christian governments inability to enforce all these laws 
international law according to regarding minorities minorities right protect human identities in its relationship between the minorities and universal value yet process capacity to divide people that if we see in the history of pakistan in, in struggle of pakistan the minorities especially the christians play a crucial role and cooperative role with the kind he told to delegation of christians parliament demands on 20 november 1942 if you help the muslim league to make pakistan you will never forget you after pakistan come into into existence and the muslim will never forget their contribution the christian minority will be scared trust for us and the protection of their lives and and properties will be a part of our duties thank you for watching my presentation